For Monday's Raw, I thought it was a good show overall, nothing too, too notable, but two things I did want to discuss. Drew McIntyre taking the final spot in the men's Money in the Bank ladder match for the Raw side of things. And also, what I thought was the, the best match of the show, Ricochet and John Morris and the former Prince Puma and Johnny Mundo from Lucha Underground uh, having a great match and an awesome spot to close it. So, your thoughts on those two things from Monday Night Raw. The McIntyre advancing, the Money in the Bank, and the Ricochet-Morrison match. I want to get your thoughts on. Yeah, I thought the Morrison and Ricochet match was great. I feel like, I don't know if they've realized what they had with Ricochet, because I feel like the last month he's been featured more and looked as, like, closest to the NXT Ricochet than he has since he got called up. So yep. that match was great. That spot was amazing. Um, just the, the way that they filmed, the, the way that they shot it just looked great. Um, but that was amazing. I thought it was a great match, like you said. Um, and then for Drew, I mean, I love Drew, but I was kind of hoping he wasn't going to be in the money of the bank. I just feel like, just like the thought of him getting the briefcase just to go off the title again, it's like, I love Drew, and it makes my stomach hurt. I'm just kind of over Drew in the title picture, so I'm hoping he gets, like, screwed by someone, even if it's gender, and then they can do that at SummerSlam. But, like, please, for the love of God, do not put the briefcase on this guy. <laughs> I know they're putting... I've said it a thousand times, the briefcase is supposed to be for someone that needs the briefcase. Drew does not need the briefcase. No, he does not, and I think it's just one of those things like where it's a loophole because he can't contend for it after losing a Lashley to Hell in a Cell where, oh, the briefcase, I can contend for it. I really hope they don't go in that direction. That wouldn't even make any sense unless he goes to SmackDown, and even then, he doesn't need the briefcase. There's so many people in this company that could use the boost. He is not one of them. I love Drew, but I hate that they even put him in the match because I know they want us to think that he might win, and he very well could. But my issue is that it does damage to him to go in there and get fucking booed as the top baby face. I mean, this is your top face in the entire company, and I guarantee fucking to you, it's not even going to be 50-50, it's going to be like 80-20 with people booing McIntyre in probably, I think it's in Philly, so, I don't know, I just thought that was dumb, but, yeah, I agree with the Ricochet stuff, I'm glad they're featuring him more, um, I thought it was a really fun match, gave me Lucha Underground flashbacks, and because it was a double countout, I really hope they do a rematch and they run it back on Monday's Raw this coming week, so... Looking forward to seeing that.